Chancellor White, being the kind of great man and leader that he is, uh, noticed that we really didn't have a good facility and that it really wasn't safe and it is old, it had been over 27 years since it had been attended to and he felt it was time that uh, we redid the track. The way he kind of looked at it is the track is a classroom for about 300 student athletes a year and that uh, this classroom needed to be remodeled and redone. We took all of this whole facility down to uh, just the dirt and we started back over with a new drainage system, new electrical wiring and uh, put down the new surface and then built the facility back up from the ground up. Along the way, uh, Chancellor White had been working behind the scenes with the undercover boss. And Chancellor White used that opportunity to talk about our university and the wonderful things and the students that we have here and then as well he used the track uh, scenario with the track being in poor shape and, and uh, we, he was a assistant coach for the day as we like to call him Coach Pete and um, that was able to air the need of the track facility which I think helped him reach out to a lot more fundraisers and people outside the university that shows that there's a need at the school and, and that there was a way for them to participate in that need. So we uh, took out the grandstands and the old track and the old surface and we put in a new Recatan uh, 3000 which is a European style track. It's a three pore system. Uh, has f over 15 millimeters of surface uh, which re really increased our force reduction. Force reduction is the, the amount of bounce that we get back off the track which helps prevent injuries and makes the athletes uh, help them run a little bit faster. As well as we also took the terrible green poles and we painted them a school color blue and uh, we uh, put up a new grandstand on that side. Uh, we have UCS equipment uh, for our competition and training. Uh, we have a coaching and a uh, spectator fence around the track that allows people to be able to get up close to the track to watch the event. And our first event will be March 10th, which will be our first home meet in eight years. It'll be against UC Santa Barbara, Big West Conference uh, team, and we'll have a dual meet out here. And uh, we're excited about that opportunity. For myself and for our student athletes and for our coaching staff, we just want to say thank you to UC Riverside and more importantly, Chancellor White to have the kind of vision and, uh, and be able to help us pull this off and make this really first class facility that's going to make a difference in student athletes lives today and well into the future and we're really excited to be here and to have this and we're looking forward to what this will mean to UC Riverside as we go down the road.